like so many other people I have seen on YouTube and here on the internet, um, for all you guys that have this WD My Cloud, I've had this for a number of years and it had a uh, four terabyte backup and there was always this issue with it would work okay. Now you're supposed to be able to plug this into your your modem or your router and it lives on the network and then your computer magically figures out what files you've changed and it just migrates them over there and creates a safe backup. Um, so since it has an ethernet port in the back and a USB port, which I can show you the remains of where it used to be. Um, you know, a lot of people had asked after the inspector comes and makes sure everything is, you know, check all the mojo in it. <clears throat> These things are fairly easy to open up. Give it a yank. And you usually wind up breaking some of the plastic tabs. So open this guy up. And what you've got here is this this case, uh, this plastic surround, and the hard drive. Basically with all the screws and crap out, this is the offending motherboard I guess it's it's basically a small computer because it's made to connect to your Ethernet and this is a USB that's supposed to essentially allow you to hook up a thumb drive or some other external storage you can't put data into this like you know you can't control the thing uh, from the USB but this thing uh, this circuit board can augment its uh, storage space through that and of course you have the power input um, but by and large Western Digital suck for um, having crappy support uh, for this thing so uh, eventually if uh, you're like me this thing becomes this whole thing becomes completely worthless and you start looking at, well, what else can I do? I've got this four terabyte uh, hard drive. I should be able to, should be able to get this thing to work somehow. Well, you know, I tried uh, hooking up a um, Ethernet cable directly from this to my main computer over here, and I was able to get that work somewhat. Um, but it was horribly slow. Um, so anyway, the way to get this thing to work is to completely throw this thing away and get an external hard drive enclosure like I've got right here. Now I found this one on Amazon, um, the RSH Tech. USB 3 to SATA 3. Um, it costs $20 free shipping. And, you know, the 4 terabyte drive is in here right now, running away. So there it is. Um, and I've already backed up uh, my hard drive and uh, let it run overnight. And, you know, stuck a terabyte worth of stuff on there when I tried to do it through the Ethernet uh, before uh, I believe I let that thing run about three days and it it was just hideously slow so anyway this is the the external drive is using a USB 3 and it's it's been working great so the way to get these things to run is to rip the drive out of it. Consider doing uh, some sort of a, a 
I don't know, torture, uh, burning an effigy or something of this piece of crap. Um, give Western Digital a piece of your mind and then put it in an external hard drive enclosure, reformat the bastard, repartition the whole thing, and you get four terabytes worth of storage back. So there you go. Never again, Western Digital, you suck. And that's pretty much all I have to say. I won't be getting your worthless MyCloud product ever again.